Air Force raids degrade Boko Haram insurgents. Nigerian Air Force has carried out air raids causing heavy damage to the Boko Haram insurgents. The Chief of Air Staff, Air Marshal Sadiq Abubakar who disclosed this also claimed that the federal government had procured aircrafts and helicopters to enhance air operations in the campaign against the terrorists. He also commended the servicemen for their dedication and gallantry in the counterinsurgency operation. The Chief of Air Staff, Air Marshal Sadiq Abubakar, on Friday, October 27, said the service had carried out air raids causing heavy damage to the Boko Haram insurgents in the northeast. Sadiq told newsman in May Ijaguri that several air raids were conducted under the Operation Ryumwuda 2, designed as a final onslaught on the insurgents. The whole idea is to further degrade the capacity of the Boko Haram insurgents and to make sure that we get them where they are hiding. And in the last few days it has been very successful, we have been able to substantially affect the necessary damage and frustrate any effort for them to regroup in certain areas of Sambiza forest. Sadiq disclosed that the federal government had procured aircrafts and helicopters to enhance air operations in the campaign against the Boko Haram insurgents as well as protect lives and property. He said that the newly acquired jets and helicopters would soon be deployed to the front line to enhance the counterinsurgency operation in the region. The chief of air staff added that the service had constructed residential accommodation and upgraded the apron at 105 composite group, May Ijaguri to accommodate the increasing number of warplanes. Sadiq explained that the projects were designed to provide enabling environment and decent accommodation to improve the well-being of the servicemen. The federal government has approved more aircraft for us and we are thinking ahead to see that we have the accommodation for those coming with these helicopters and aircrafts the government has procured for us. With more aircrafts you have to expand the parking space. We have reactivated a quite a number and more are coming. What we thought was to quickly expand the apron so that we have enough space for the aircrafts that are coming to be able to park. For us in the Air Force, we are always working, training, expanding infrastructure, building capacity for both the pilots, technicians and engineers. While lauding the government's gesture, Sadiq also commended the servicemen for their dedication and gallantry in the counterinsurgency operation. Com had reported that the chief of the air staff, Air Marshal Sadiq Abubakar, commissioned a liquid oxygen plant at Nigerian Air Force Base Yola on Monday, July 10. According to the information provided, the commissioned plant has the capacity to produce 1,000 liters of liquid oxygen every eight hours, more than required for NAF operations. Yeah.